sat down on the cash bar or gasped with the air so it poured through his forehead and into the sand veil of the ground. Hello and welcome everybody, this is your host Leerbach and <laughs> we're playing more Amnesia, a game that really likes to disturb you with fleshy growths. Uh, oh, this is... Uh, ow. Really? Uh... I didn't take damage from that. <laughs> cool. Okay, so we're gonna go into the laboratory and finish up this mixture that we've been trying to do for the past two episodes. Oh. Mm. Two three days in Algeria. Ah, didn't have enough time to finish reading that. Um. So yeah, apparently, as we're progressing through this, the world, the the place is becoming a putrid, you know, abomination. I can only imagine is is uh, well, craftian in origin. I'm not going near that. I remember what happened last time we did that. Let's see, crystal clear here. Yeah. I guess after seeing that, after seeing that fleshy growth a couple of times, it would end up becoming normal eventually. Let's see, is our little spooky friend down here still? Nope. So, let's see, what do you find? Ah, here we go. Let's see here. Okay. Go ahead and light that up. Um, by the way, if you ever see me do this, leaning, um, I'm, I'm pressing the E, thinking I'm going to uh, activate stuff. It's, you know, this is one of those weird games where that's not the case. Um, yes, yeah, so let's go ahead and. I have a, feel, I have a feeling we're going to have to. Okay, in order, Calmine, Orpiment, and Culprite. Okay, I'm gonna guess... It's a good Calamine. Start here. Oh, okay, so it doesn't matter, it seems to do it automatically. Orpiment. Cooperite. Okay, and you know, let's do Opera Regia as fast as we can. Do a circular motion. The wheel will turn the same direction you rotate. Okay, so we just had to turn the things on. Um. Trying to do this in the right order, just in case. Uh, right. Oh. Okay. Thank goodness. Yeah, try this again. Correct order. Actually, not that bad rotating though. It's pretty uh, generous. Okay, and okay. Got a pot of acid. Boy, could I use some acid right now with this? <laughs> and not the kind. And not the kind we have. <laughs> Get it? Actually, that would probably be a bad idea. That'd probably be a very, very bad idea. 
<laughs> like, I'm talking like, we'd probably be like, you know, freaking out even more. Whoa, what the? Uh, Ah, uh, the stairs, really? Yep. Uh, so, God, this place sucks. And of course, this seems to have been broken down. Oh, uh, I think you can find a chair. Let's hope this will do. And will it work this time? Nope. Okay, so that's not gonna work. Um. either. Climbing up stuff is probably not going to work. Okay, um... Hmm. Okay. Something tells me I have to do something here. I'm not sure what it is. Is there another way? Do we have like a map of this area? Excuse me. Nope. Okay. Um. Hmm. Well, this is. Just great. <laughs> I'm lost again. As far as I know, there aren't any secrets. There aren't any secret passages here. Um. Can't go any further in there. You know what? Go ahead and... Go ahead and try this out, see if it'll work. Not liking the, uh... Roman. Noises in the background, they aren't. They aren't pleasant noises. They're not stuff I want to ever hear. Even on a, even taking into account that this, even in a situation that's not Um, no, I'm in lights. That, that should be light right there, so I, should be, I shouldn't have to worry about... So I'm hearing a hard, little faint heartbeat. I'm assuming I need to light my lamp. Pull my lantern. Um... Okay, though, let's, uh, let's 
go back into the entrance hall. And... Strumpin. Lost smell of desert and damp musk. The pieces lay scrambled on top. Too many of them, he thought, and perhaps too few. And of course, we got this growth still here, and... Yeah, for giving us a slight headache, and holy crap, it's gotten even worse. Oh. Uh, uh. I wonder if that stuff, the stuff that's been blowing up in our face. I guess it's like a boil or something. Okay, so, now that we're out of there, um. Look. We got the stuff to deal with this, so we uh, burn it up. Human, human. Fl oh, great! The stuff behind it is even worse. And it's the end of the refinery. It became impossible to avoid. The commotion in the street begged for his attention. As he opened the shutter, the French soldiers opened fire on the two young men fighting back. Their voices were silenced in a haze of gun smoke. Okay, so we are now in the refinery. At long last, and it sure is dark in here. Yes, and there's a good reason for it. But you can light oh, the lamp course. now if you wish. What's the reason for the darkness? That is, stay close. Be careful not to stray. What's the reason? Why is it so dark? Pay attention, Dandel. It's important this to is keep going not straight good. and make sure not to stray. So we got enemies to worry about now. Given the hint. Um. Oh crud. What in the what in the ever living heck is that? You know, this fleshy growth all over the place is not. Oh, crud. I got a slight headache. <laughs> the least of my problems right now, oddly enough. Um. Well, proper consensus says to go away from the monster since it's heading in the opposite direction. So. Got at least a bit of a safe spot, at least as far as sanity is concerned. Got some log them. Mm -hmm. Okay, and we got another note, so we'll go ahead and read the notes. Second of June, eighteen thirty-nine. It's been more than a month since my last entry. After the event inside the underground chamber in Algeria, Professor Herbert insisted I return to England. He said he didn't want to risk forfeiting the entire expedition lest I took a turn for the worse. An excessive decision, in retrospect. But I'm glad it turned out that way. I found my journal this morning in the haphazard collection of things brought home from Africa. Next to it lay the broken stone orb wrapped in cloth. I tried to assemble it, but couldn't. The pieces wouldn't fit together, as if they weren't from the same object. Could I have imagined it all? Was there ever a complete orb? Hmm. So, well, we are going to have to go this way, I have a feeling. And of course, more growth. Like this up just to be safe. There's a little bit of the safety net for It's gonna tell us we had to find Yep. Well, um You know what? I think I'm gonna go ahead and end the episode off here for now. So in the next episode we'll be 
continuing on and trying to find a way into the back room. And hopefully not getting caught by the whatever those things are that are just walking around. Have a have a mm, have a feeling it's not gonna be good. <laughs> but anyway, we'll worry about that in the next episode. So for the time being, however, I will see you guys later. Three, two, one, zero.